Eyewitness News is your back to school authority and the start of the new school year is just around the corner. So this morning we're taking a closer look at how parents of high schoolers can help make sure that their child's transition back to school goes smoothly. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter A. Galel spoke with several teachers and has some advice. I think that for kids to get back and and be around other people and um, have that that social interaction, it's so important um, developing those social skills. Jimmy Wildman is preparing for his 16th year of teaching Spanish at Glastonbury High School. As summer winds down and families get ready to start the new school year, he says it's important for parents to be involved in the process. Reach out to teachers, reach out to, to school counselors. Um, if there's a, a question or a concern, don't wait, just be proactive and really be a part of that process so that things don't come as a surprise. School districts have been preparing all summer long for the return to school. Teachers at schools are going to meet kids where they are. Mark Janik, a Suffield High School math teacher, says many schools will be offering different programs to make sure students are not behind. A lot of uh, schools are going to be using the, the money, federal money to make sure sure that any gap is filled. So just check with programs. They'll be after school programs, before school programs, during the day. And for students who are struggling, it's important they have a trusted adult they can turn to. I think it's something important as adults we constantly remind our kids. When they're suffering from an issue, we need to train them and give them the tools to learn how to talk about it, to share about it, and we can help direct them to the right resources. Crucial measures so that students can have a successful school year. All we do is want the best for them and then we're all here to support them, and they will be successful. Ayagalel, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.